Hello, hello everybody, welcome on in. I am Ori. Today we are going to be playing Sworn, an upcoming game that is a Hades like type game. It is an open play test right now, so I believe anybody can request access to it and they'll get it, I think. So if you want to try this game out right now, go ahead and go on Steam and request access to the play test. I have not played this yet, so I am interested to see how I have seen videos for it. I have not played it yet, so I'm curious to see how good this game is and how it compares to Hades. It looks very similar. It plays very similar. Um, it does have co-op. We're not going to do co-op, though. We're just going to do solo. So let's jump in. Let's see what we think about this game. Um, OK, so we get a little bit of an intro. Uh, 50 years after Arthur seized power. Oh, okay, so we just jump right into it. Um, okay, I am a controller player. So let's play with our controller. Okay, so let's figure out the controller buttons. Okay, so we have a light attack. We have a heavy attack. We have a dash. And we have some sort of energy spell. We need energy for that. Okay, let's go. Okay, so we have this guy. So yeah, very very similar to Hades. Uh, Hades was a was an amazing game. Uh, <laughs> I played that game a lot, especially when it first came out in early access. I, funny enough, I never played the game after um, <laughs> after it went full release. I only played it I only played it through early access. So even when that game got a 1.0 release, I I never actually played it. Uh, what is this? Uh, press A to accept Titania, Queen of the Fae, or Gogmagog, the last giant. Let's do the last giant. Okay, so we're going to get a light attack is stronger and inflicts stagger. Your spells deal extra damage or your dash emits quake where you land. Let's do our light attack is stronger. And it does a stagger. Okay, so we are low on health. If there, can we recharge by picking these things up? I don't think so. You know, some games sometimes there'll be hearts in the in the pots. Not this game. Oh, that's a bomb. Oh my gosh. Okay. We're probably. I mean, we're probably not gonna live too long. As I imagine that we're probably not meant to survive very long on this first run, you know? Because we don't have any of the meta upgrades or anything. Okay, what's this gonna do? Uh gives me 10 something. Grail water? I don't know what grail water is. Probably some I'm assuming something we need to do upgrades. Okay, so this is looks like maybe coins. Oh, we got some cool mortar enemy. Combat feels pretty good. I don't know if anything's ever going to feel as good as Hades did, but who knows. So, oh yeah, so that's like 100 gold, right? Yep, exactly gold. Okay, heal, or I don't know what the banner is. We're going to do health because I'm pretty low on health, though. So let's check this out. Um, do we have to fight to get our health? We do. Oh no, something shot at me and I didn't see it. There was an enemy that was obstructed by the, the pillar. Oh, we're dead. We just died. <laughs> My dash cooldown ran out. Oh, okay. So what is this? Hold on. What what are we doing here? Um. Okay. So I have I I can only pick one thing. There's wealth, treasure, devotion, war, or life. Um. So what exactly are we doing here? Okay. So I can't do any of these. So I have to do life stuff first. 
This looks like our meta progression, so let's, um... Okay, let's use the mouse for this one. So I have to... These ones... It's weird, because some of these... See how some of these are grayed out, and some of them aren't? But I can only select this one. This is the only one I can actually select. So restore one health at the beginning of every room. Okay, so we'll unlock that. And then, let's see. When you are revived, return with 10 more health. Start each run with 10 max health. Uh, gain a 5% chance that rooms will contain a breakable pot with health inside. <laughs> See? That's exact. That's exactly what I was talking about. Sometimes the pots will have health. Uh, let's do the max health, though. Okay, and so now we're broke. Uh, exit. Um, so do you have to spend your stuff after each run? Exit. You have completed your first run of Sworn. Online play is now available. Okay. Okay, so now we're in our little hub world. Oh, there's going to be different characters. Sweet. So there's Spectre. I wish you could. I wish we could see what the other characters were. Like, I wish I could see what weapons they had, even though you can't unlock them. Okay, so this is cool. So you get four different characters, each with different abilities. Um, this character is just vigilante. It looks like they get. Oh, it looks like they each get different weapons, too. Sweet. Yeah, I wish I could see what these characters had to offer. That's a bummer. Okay, so we get a remote mine, a flurry of daggers, or shadow strike. And then with this other character, we get a giant hammer, a great hammer. And then we can do a counter attack. If you are hit during this time, retaliate and damage all enemies around you. Dash forward with great force, knocking enemies back. Launch yourself into the air and crash down. That's cool. Okay, let's try. Let's just try the new character. Like, our, our tanky. So it looks like everybody kind of has the same type of attacks, right? Oh, that's sweet, though. So he does a smash. And then he has just a... Oh, if I hold it, though. Hold on. If I hold it, it's more of a whirlwind attack. And I can do it forever. <laughs> I can do it forever. What if I can do it forever? Or if it takes energy or something. Okay, let's talk to Merlin. Uh, welcome back, Squire. I'm sure you have many questions, but there is little time. The Grail's corruption has spread far and wide, and we must cleanse it. The very knights that once swore to defend this kingdom are now its downfall. Hope yet remains, as you, as with you rests the second chance. I shall do what I can to assist you, Squire. Okay, so, so here's our meta upgrade stuff, which we've already spent. What does the Fisher King have for us? So it's true, the Grail has graced us with a second chance. The world has changed since you've been gone, Squire. Corruption has spread throughout the land, even infecting the local wildlife of the Weryl Forest. Take heed, Squire. The road ahead will be dangerous. I wish you luck. I'll lend any aid these old bones can muster. Okay, what do you offer? A Blessing Compendium. Oh, so this is... So you're just going to tell me what everything is. Wow, this is... Pr what's what's a round table blessing? So there's ability blessings, standard blessings, duo blessings. So that must mean if you have, like, similar gods, like, maybe, maybe these two gods can interact with each other and have a duo blessing. And then I wonder what a round table blessing is. That's pretty exciting. There's a, there's a lot. So we have what? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight gods. Each of them with about like, geez, I don't know, four and then like 15. So each one probably has like close to 20 abilities each. I wonder if the duo blessings are repetitive though, you know, like if, if they cross over between the same characters. That's sweet. Okay, what else is there? There's this up here. Who, who are you? Nimu. Greetings, child of the Grail. I am Nimu, Lady of the Lake, and fabricator of legendary armaments. Not of the least, the blade you now wield, one of my finer works. I don't have a blade. May it serve you well, child of the Grail. Okay, so you don't do anything yet. Maybe you'll make my weapon stronger, though? Oh, maybe. Can I interact here? No? Okay, it looks like you have the forge, though, right? You're gonna... You're probably going to up, up, uh, upgrade my weapons, maybe? Okay, let's try to do a run. With our new character, Rook. Oh, bad start.
I like this whirlwind. This is pretty sweet. I like that I can especially just hold it down. Okay, so we got a banner. What's the banner do? Oh, so the banner is going to let me pick an upgrade. Okay, let's do Queen of Spiders or Mother of Banshees. Let's do the Banshees. Okay, your light attack is stronger and now inflicts weak. Uh, your heavy attack is stronger and inflicts weak. Uh, your dash shoots two soul missiles. Let's try that. I'm just all about trying to see what things are. We know what... The attacks aren't exciting. You know, we know we know what they're going to do. They're just going to do an attack and they're going to add. Man, do these missiles not lock on to pe anyone, though? These missiles suck. They just shoot out to... The, is that really all they do? Yeah, these missiles are... What is, what is these missiles? These missiles are horrible. They don't even lock on. I thought they were going to lock on. That's a horrible. That's a that's a bad idea, I think. <laughs> they really need to be right next to you. So it only works if they're next to you. And if they're on the side of you, I don't like that. We won't be taking that one again. OK, what does this do? 10 fairy ember. That's a different type of resource. Okay, so uh, let's just go the easier route, I think. I don't think I want to do an elite room. Man, I can't believe those missiles don't walk onto a target. Yeah, this is... I, I can already tell you right now, when this game comes out, I'm buying it. You know, this is... <laughs> This game's already an instant buy. I, I like this game already. I loved Hades. Hades was a really fun game. I wish I would have played it more, but sometimes I just have so many games I need to play, I can't play everything as much as I want to. But I did play Hades to Hades just in early access. Okay, let's do... Oh, we can get gold or... Let's do the Mother of Banshees again. Okay, so take less damage from all enemies... Um, gain spirit charge over time from enemies afflicted by weak. Spirit charge consumed by attacks that inflict weak to increase. Hold on. Gain spirit charge over time from enemies inflicted with weak. And so consumed by attacks that inflict weak to increase damage by 50%. Sure, let's try that. But we can't inflict... I guess that's not a good one, because I don't think we inflict weak. Unless this inflicts weak, but it's not that good. Okay, let's see what the horn is. Oh no, we got stuck in our attack. And I didn't have a dash. Where's my dash meter at? Do I have a dash meter? Oh, I forgot I have a special ability. Oh, so he can do... Hold on, what does this do? Does it just block? Can I see what this does? Is that the retaliate? That might be the retaliate. Okay. Oh, so this is just an upgrade for ours. So we get an upgrade. So now your dash shoots two soul missiles and they do more damage. Oh, great. More damage that's not going to hit anything. Okay. So let's just go to the regular banner again. I don't think this would be a character I normally play. I generally like um, some sort of ranged character in these type of games. So I'll probably play, man, I, I'll probably play some sort of character that has a bow or long range attacks, especially the slower characters. I don't like the slower characters that much. Like this guy, I'll definitely never probably, this will never be my main character when I play this game, I don't think, but who knows. I do like this whirlwind thing where we can just do it nonstop. 
Okay, so we can either do the Hand of Fate or the Last Giant. Let's try the Hand of Fate because we haven't seen that one yet. Uh, so let's see. Your Light Attack is stronger and can critical hit. Your Heavy Attack is stronger and can critical hit. Or your Spell is stronger and can critical hit. Uh, let's just do our Light Attack and can critical hit. And then what do you do? You're going to heal me? You peer into the orb and see 50 health. It seems like you could almost reach out and grab it. Uh, yeah. <laughs> oh, great. It was a trap. Imagine I'm gonna die here trying to heal myself. What does this do again? So does it just block or does it actually, or is it the retaliate spell? I can't remember. Okay, so it is a retaliate, because that guy took 100 damage. Maybe, does it not work on long range? Because I don't think they take damage. Okay, so we got health. That was, well, that wasn't 50 health. Didn't it say 50? That wasn't 50. All right, let's try the judgment. Or the scales, whatever you want to call it. Oh, so this is a shop. Uh, and I have no gold. Awesome. So I'm straight up broke. This is, yeah, this is cool. This is, this is very, <laughs> very Hades-like. This is only an early alpha playtest, too, so... Be, it'll be fun to see what, what they add to it as this game uh, moves forward, you know? Man, <laughs> I wish it wouldn't activate if you didn't block. I want to test this out. See, it just blocks it. But if they're near, if they're within range, it'll... It'll do damage. So it does like a small AoE if they're close to me. See, so, okay. That could be, that, oh, yikes. That could be cool, though. Wonder if I have to be looking at it, too. Okay, so now we're gonna get, what is this? You peer into the orb and see 20 something. Um, yeah, I th think we can do this. So I think it does work. I think the block does work, even if I'm not facing them. Dang it. Because I don't think I was facing that guy when I did it. Oh, that was pretty sweet. I knocked him back into the thing. Oh no, oh no. That was a mistake. Okay. Well, at least, see, we got seven. I guess you can only get up to, because it's definitely not giving us as much as it says it's going to. Okay, so this is a boss fight. We're probably going to die, right? I only have, what, seven health? Ten health? Seven? Oh, yeah, we're dead. <laughs> we're dead. All right, death. Um, okay, so I need to have way more points to unlock these. Okay, so let's go back and do... Let's do the breakable pots. Wait. Why can't I do this? Oh my gosh, I didn't get any. So what are these then? These are different currencies. Dang it. So I have no currency to do level ups. That's rough. That's rough that we didn't get anything. What are these for, though? Oh, okay, so these require 20 of these. What are these ones for, then? There's nothing on here for those. Thank you for giving Sworn a try. There's still much more to fight in this demo if you're up for the challenge. If you've enjoyed this experience so far, uh, don't show again. We already got you. Okay. Do I need these to buy the characters? No. Okay, for the abilities. Or the weapons. Okay, I'm going to unlock the bow then. Or chakrams. Bow staff or straight up bow. And then what do you have? A hand cannon. 
a great sword or gauntlets. Okay, so these are to unlock our abilities, huh? Okay, well, let's unlock the bow. And then we can do a remote mine, flurry of daggers, or teleport behind an enemy. So can I do all of these, can I, or can I only have one equipped at a time? Wait, this is so this is his uh this is his heavy attack. No enemies in range. Okay, so we do do a shadow strike. So we can only have you can only have one ability at a time. Um yeah, oh, shoots hold So a precise range bow, hold attack to charge, shoots bombs behind to detonate them. Oh, that could be interesting. Okay, let's try this out then real quick. Okay, what do you have to say? Always a pleasure, Squire. On days such as this, I find myself nostalgic for my childhood. The lands were beautiful, fields fertile, with endless skies and a gentle breeze that one could not help but admire. I do so hope to see it again someday before my time comes. Go, Squire, and take back our kingdom. Thank you. Okay, let's try one more run. I do wish... Hmm, I wish the bombs would explode into them, though. Uh, if they touch the bombs, I wish they would explode. So the only way to make... Er, okay, so they're on a timer, too. Range determines damage, too, apparently. Oh, uh, there's perfect attacks. That's what I need to do. Perfect attack, then. Okay, so let's do King of Fae or the Last Giant. Let's try King of Fae. Uh, okay, so when you dash, we summon a Whirlwind. Or... It doesn't seem like there's a ton of different abilities here, right? It seems like our attacks either give us an on-hit ability or our dash does something. It looks like there's a couple other things. There's maybe a companion? I'm looking on the far right. There's, there's one more bottom icon, so I wonder if we can get a companion of some sort. Okay, so let's see. Your light attacks give you fury on hit. Successive hits increase the damage of your fury attacks. Or this is uh, your spell gives you fury on hit. Let's just go with our light attack. I know this is a rare, but I feel like that's not as good having it on the spell. I might as well just put it on my light attack, so I'll use that a ton. Okay, what is... I guess we're gonna go to the non-legend, the non-elite one. Oh, we can't throw it across that thing either, huh? Yeah, see, that was a good... Because now our attacks are being increased every time. Where's this last guy at? So we see 17, 18, 19, 20, 21. Each time we're doing more damage. That's a pretty good one, especially for the bow. Oh, I, I have to remember I have my back attack. Ooh. <laughs> I have my back attack too. Uh, I forget what the horn did already. Upgrades the spell. Uh, let's take the gold, so if I see a shop, I can actually buy stuff this time. Let's 
See, this is more, this is more the style I like. Ooh, did he trigger that? Okay, we'll get our coin. See, so this says 120 coins, so... Um... Let's ignore it for now. Okay, let's do the banner. I like I like the bow. The bow is this is pretty sweet. I don't know if I care too much for the um let's let the level blessing. Okay, so that's gonna do 10% bonus now, huh? Um what is this again? Potion? We're not gonna do the elite stuff though. I mean we're gonna I'm gonna take it as easy as I can here, because I can barely even get to the boss, let alone beat him. Man, you could really rack up the attack damage here. So we can get up to 30 attack power, so basically doubling our damage almost. And that's just off a normal attack. What did that do? 10? Oh man, I'm not getting the right resources though. It's, it's this hard. It's hard not getting the resources we need to do the meta progression upgrades. Oh shoot. <laughs> oh, okay. So this is like a trap room, huh? Holy cow, how much more do we have to go? Sure, there's a quicker way to do this, but man. Okay, we did it. We got 20 health. Okay. <laughs> uh, let's do Frozen Witch or Dark Omen. Let's try Dark Omen. Okay, your heavy attack can backstab, deals bonus damage when striking from behind. Probably not going to be doing that a lot. Um, your dash leaves behind a shade. Let's do that, I guess. Okay, let's go right up the middle. Just kidding, I guess we can't. Okay, let's go to the shop. We do have some gold this time. Not enough to buy anything, apparently. We can buy an upgrade. How much do we have? 120. And there's a boss fight, though. Let's buy the heal. That doesn't heal me. Is what? Okay, no way. It was 50 gold. It was 50 gold. Not 50 health. That only healed me for like 20. Oh, it's a different boss, too. I don't like these dash abilities. You have to be... Man, you have to be right on it for it to work. Keep my stacks up as best as I can.
got them. Let's go! We beat our first boss, and we got ten of these. So that's uh, I don't. That's the stuff we need for the character. Oh, that was just like a mini boss. Oh man. Okay, let's do the health. <laughs> where's our Where's our meta upgrade stuff though? Why is none of that dropping? I don't know why no meta upgrade stuff is dropping. Oh no, it bounces right off the thing, huh? And we lost our combo. Yeah, I wish the dash stuff was a little bit better. I would like to see it seek out enemies and do stuff. Okay, I do have the upgrade, I think, where I can... Oh, wait, no, I couldn't afford that, so never mind. Um, this is blocked. Or maybe that's not even really a path. Okay, let's try... I forget what this does again. Oh, is this our... This is the meta... Okay, this is the meta upgrade stuff. So we have to make sure that we're taking this one then. We don't just get it for fighting, it seems like. So yeah, we got 10 of that. Uh, what's this? A secret shop. Uh, we move faster. You have an additional mana charge. For 50 gold. That seems pretty good. 20% movement speed? Or let's do the extra charge. So that means I could do my... Whatever my little backstab is. Strange mushroom. Uh, along your path, you notice a strange mushroom. It glows. Iridescent. Ir Iris. Iridescent blue, iridescent, iridescent blue, and its surface bubbles with a thick ooze. You recall descriptions of a similar mushroom as a powerful alchemical ingredient. At least you're pretty sure. So we'll gain two charges, but lose all regeneration. No, I just got an extra charge, so I don't think I want to lose regeneration. Okay, let's do the heal. Sometimes it doesn't attack the guy who I wanted to attack. <clears throat> My special ability. Oh no, that was a bad one. That took me right on top of that. I like this backdash ability, though, because it kind of works as a dodge, too, you know? The bomb is the bomb is pretty cool, too. The bomb's growing on me. Yeah, let's get our health. Ooh, we can't run through that little creek, huh? <laughs> this little, little canal in the middle of us, we can't run through that. That's interesting. It's such a small... I could literally step over that. That means I can't throw my bombs through there, either.
Okay, well, that'll be helpful. Okay, 120 gold. Let's take it. Yeah, so we lose gold based... So, yeah, we lose gold based on uh, how quickly we do this. No, I thought we did it. <laughs> oh, man. Okay, is that it? Oh, come on. Where's... Oh, no. All right, 60 gold. Okay, 60 gold. All right, a banner. We're going to need some heals here. Is this healing? would know if it would let me hit it. Did that heal me? I think it did. Oh no! Oh no, I didn't get out of there in time. Dang it. Okay, upgrade a spell or the Dark Omen. Um, let's try Dark Omen. Your backstabs. Ugh. Your spell can backstab. Oh, okay. Actually, this one's this is okay. Deal bonus damage when striking an enemy from behind, and our ability does a ability. I think is literally a backstab. Okay, let's do. Let's do the upgrade ability. Let's just... I have enough gold for a heal, so I think we're okay if we get to another boss fight here soon. Oh no, I... I was thought I dodged out of that. I guess not. Okay, we're gonna do the Fury again. I'm just, the only thing, the only downside I think is these dash abilities. I don't like these dash abilities at all so far. At least the few we've seen. Oh my gosh, I can't afford the heal. Oh, this is max health. Man, where's just my normal heal? You don't have a normal heal in the shop before a boss? That's rough. That's rough, come on. This looks like an actual boss fight now. Cool. Sir... Sir Gawain. Butcher of the world. Oh, shoot. Yeah, see? Backstab every time. <gasps> Man, we do, like, no damage on this guy. <laughs> Oh, what's this, a charge? Oh, no, no, no. Ooh, this guy's tough, this guy's tough. Okay, we're done. That was fun, that's a, that's a cool boss too. Tough boss, but a good boss. Okay, we can increase our health more. Or no, no, I thought, hmm, I thought we could do more, so we can't. When you were revived, when you were revived, but how do we revive? I wish I had something that I knew what could revive me. Start each run with 10 max health. Um, let's see. Let's unlock war first. Let's just unlock this and see what this has to offer too. So gain one dash charge. Yes. Speed increase. Increase your base damage. Sure. So what's this thing in the middle? Deal 50% damage to enemies above 90 health. Um, 
So what is... Hold on. What's this one going to do then? Deal more damage the more curse you have. That doesn't sound great. <laughs> um, let's go with life and we'll do the max health again. And let's see if there's anything else exciting in town. So I have 30 now. Oh, I forgot we can unlock our characters too. I, I'll save up for the new characters. So I can buy new weapons or new abilities. We'll we'll save those for last time, for next time. Okay, let's see if you have anything to say. Hail, child of the grail. Have you made good use of my blades? They served Arthur well in his years as king. There are few I would find worthy of my armaments. In my many years, there has been but a handful. In you, I see something, a song yet to be sung, a tale yet to be told. Now go, let all hear of your legend. Okay. Hail, Squire, make sure to bring me any relics you encounter on your travels. They will be vital for enhancing the power granted to you by the Grail. Okay. And then last but not least, the Fisher King. Sometimes I wonder, is this land still worth saving? Its lakes poisoned, its trees whittled, the soil eroded. If we were able to reclaim our home, how much is truly free to go back to? Forgive me, Squire, I mustn't think such things. Let me not keep you. May the Fae Lords bless you, Squire. Cool, okay. Well, so, well there we go. That That's gonna be it for our playthrough of Sworn. Uh, sweet game. It, it's definitely one of those Hades action roguelike games. Uh, I think it holds up really well, though. It's going to be... It feels like this is going to be a really solid game when it comes out. Uh, it's definitely going to be on my radar. I'm pretty much 100% probably going to buy this when it releases it, when it releases, and then we'll do, we'll try playing through it a little bit. Uh, yeah, this is a really cool game. Really cool game. All right, everybody, that's going to be it. If you enjoy these videos, please drop a like. Please subscribe to the channel. Uh, I cover all types of games like this, roguelikes, especially uh, horde survival games. So if you're new to the channel, uh, feel free to check out all my other videos. We, we play a lot of different types of games. And then, yeah, thank you so much for watching, everybody. I hope you have a great rest of your day.